I have a habit of taking my kids on dates and we plan these dates. We find that the anticipation of the date is as satisfying as the realization. So we think about it for a long period of time. I came to one of my daughters and said, honey, tonight's your night. What is your choice? What would you like to do? Well, dad, that's okay. No, really, what would you like to do? Well, what I want to do, you really don't want to do. Well, really, honey, I, I want to do it. No matter what it is, it's yours. No, no, I know you don't. I know you don't want to do it. I want to go to Star Wars, and I know how much you don't like Star Wars. You slept during Star Wars. You don't like these fantasy-type movies. I know you don't. So that's okay, Dad. No, honey, if that's what you'd like to do, I'd like to. Uh, Dad, you're just trying to do your daddy thing. Don't worry about it. We don't always have to have this date. By the way, Dad, you know why you don't like Star Wars? Because you don't understand the philosophy and training of a Jedi Knight. <laughs> I said, what? What was that? You know the stuff you teach, Dad? That's the same things that go into the training of a Jedi Knight. Let's go to Star Wars. And we did. And she sat next to me and gave me the paradigm. And I became her student, her learner. We went to all three. It's totally fascinating. I could begin to see out of a new paradigm the whole way that a Jedi Knight's basic philosophy and training is manifested in different circumstances. That was not just a P experience, it was a PC experience. It was bonding in our relationship and very satisfying in its fruit. We got golden eggs and also the quality of the relationship, the goose, was significantly fed.